Hello you guys, welcome back to my channel. Unless this is your first time seeing my face, then hello, my name is Emily Burton and I'm so happy to have you here. Welcome to another day in Hallotuber. Today, if you couldn't tell from the title, the thumbnail, and me, I am going to be turning myself into Betty Cooper from Riverdale. She is my favorite Riverdale character. I guess you could say Riverdale Vixen, for sure. Um, I don't know, I'm just channeling her super hard right now <laughs> especially with my high pony i'm feeling it loving it <laughs> my voice is going away so if you want to see how to create this super simple betty cooper costume for halloween then just keep on watching so for betty cooper she always has like just like a clean base going on and just like minimal makeup so I'm just going to put on some moisturizer. I'm also going to uh, put on some Too Faced Lip Injection Extreme. I don't know why I gotta say words so weird, but I do. <laughs> I'm actually going to be mixing two foundations, the same brand but different colors. This is the CoverGirl Vitalize Healthy Elixir. I'm gonna be mixing ivory with a bit of buff beige, just because her color is a little bit more sun-kissed than mine, because I'm a ghost. So I'm just gonna like, I'm almost out of the ivory. Ah, there we go. Is that ivory? Yeah, okay. So I did two pumps of ivory, and now I'm going to just do one pump of buff beige and then just blend this in with a beauty blender I always forget my primer and once again I have forgotten my primer so you would prime before this step but we're already here a bit of concealer and hide these little pimples that I have and conceal under my eyes in the tiniest way. And now I'm gonna set it all with my Fit Me powder in fair light. with some blush because Betty Cooper is just girl next door and I feel like she wears blush. I, just, I feel like it. Blend with a lighter hand, um, but just simple brows, you know what I mean? I'm going to spritz my face with my uh, rose water hydrating face mist. Cause I feel like stuff is kind of getting a little cakey. Two eyeshadows on my eyes because she doesn't have a lot of eye makeup. So I'm gonna go in with Will C from my Marc Jacobs palette. This is the editorial palette. And place this in my crease just a little bit. My Jaclyn Hill Morphe palette and take this color which is faint and a little bit of sissy and just put this all over the lids because it is pink. You know, I could have freaking put on the shirt that I was gonna wear, but I just remembered that I was actually gonna do that. So, yeah. Now I'm gonna go back into We'll See and just take the tiniest bit and rub it, or and put this on my lower lash line. I'm gonna line my lips today. I'm just gonna take two pink colors. This one is from ColourPop and it is Clueless. And this one is the Maybelline Superstay Matte Ink in Dreamer. I'm gonna take a little bit of Clueless first. A little bit of the Superstay. 
blend it in with my finger. And then she always has a pretty gloss on, so I'm just gonna use the lip plumper once again because it's literally the only gloss that I have. I'm actually gonna go change before I do the ponytail. So give me just a moment and I'll be right back. Okay, I have my Betty sweater on. She usually opts for like pastel colors or pink. She's very, very girly, but also very, very cool. She is my favorite character, if you couldn't tell. <laughs> I've actually got both of my lights plugged into the outlet. My hair is actually pretty curly as it is, but if you wanted to get the same ponytail look that Betty has on a regular basis, what I suggest is to use a one inch curling iron. We'll see, we'll see. Let me just get my hair up into the ponytail and I might actually unplug a light and curl it, so. We'll see. I'm gonna take my wet brush and just brush my hair back. So I'm just gonna like pull my hair up into that ponytail and then we'll brush it out to smooth it. pretty curly so I'm just gonna twist it. Do I look like Betty yet? I think I do. I think I did a decent job. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know it wasn't like too hard of a costume for Halloween but that's what I'm aiming for are super simple DIY costumes with things that you already have in your closet or in your makeup bag. Have fun with it. I would love to see your guys' recreations, so be sure to tag me on Instagram with hashtag HalloTuber or hashtag Emily Burton. And yeah, if you haven't already, please be sure to hit that big red subscribe button down below and subscribe to my channel. In October, I am posting a new video every single day and calling it HalloTuber, so you don't want to miss another video, so be sure to subscribe and turn the post notifications bell on. That way you'll be notified each time that I post a new video. That is all that I have for you today, so I will see you guys in tomorrow's video. Bye!